Teaching children about sex can be a challenge sometimes. I want to give you some solutions to navigate this with your children. I'm Dr. Scott Taransky with the National Center for Biblical Parenting. I've been working with families for over 30 years. I coach parents in all kinds of things, and I train, co I train coaches to work with their parents that they are ministering to. So uh, let me tell you some ideas about teaching your children about sex. First of all, you wanna do it across the developmental uh, spectrum. When we're working with children who are preschoolers, that's where we start. We're teaching them about privacy, we're teaching them about um, uh, gender, and we're teaching them uh, just about their bodies and, and uh, names for body parts and so on. So we're starting with when they're young. Then during the elementary age years, six to nine say, we're, we're talking about where the babies come from. We're not talking about sexual intercourse yet. We're talking about where babies come from. And so we're helping uh, parents to understand what that looks like, that, there, that there's a uterus and the baby grows in that uterus and, and so on. So uh, we're talking about those things with children. Now, when children turn to 10 to 12, we wanna be teaching them more about puberty and what's gonna happen to their bodies and changes, how their body's changing. And that's when we're gonna introduce more about this idea about sexual intercourse. And then when they're teenagers, we're gonna certainly be talking about all kinds of issues with them. Uh, in regards to relationships, uh, how, how men and women think differently, and how uh, to handle those relationships in ways that are the best so that we can launch them. We wanna be talking about all kinds of different issues, as you might imagine, uh, that these children are facing at all ages. We wanna be able to approach them because we want children to hear it from us first. If you're not talking to your kids about this subject, you're the only one who isn't. They're hearing about it in the media. They are hearing about it at school. Their friends are talking about it and uh, you want to be proactive about having discussions with your children because this is such a great gift that God has given to us. It's something that we don't wanna just say is taboo. We wanna, we wanna express its, its beauty and its glory in its proper context. And so we're teaching children what that looks like. If children have a biblical worldview when they come to this subject, it will help them so much because this is one area where a lot of people get off track and find themselves damaged in their lives. So let's protect our children, teach them at all the developmental stages. If you are starting later, just cover the same material and, because that's what you do. Each uh, developmental stage, you review what you learned previously and you continue on. So wherever you're picking this up, have the conversations with your kids. It'll help them greatly. We have resources on our website. I just posted a new one about sexual identity and you can see that at biblicalparenting.org forward slash blog.